Hi everyone, welcome back to another interview series. My name is Meher from Newfoundland and Labrador. And today I have the privilege to interview Dominic Imweli from Ohio. Hi Dominic, how are you doing? Hey Meher, thanks for thanks for having me. I really appreciate it. I'm doing good. It's a, it's a Friday. I'm excited to be here. Yeah, thank you for being here. So you believe that uh, people should obtain their career dreams and that's what you come to help professionals and other job seekers. Your clients have landed roles in Oracle, Deloitte, uh, Salesforce, KPMG, or they started their own venture, which is great. But landing your dream job doesn't happen by chance, and your successful clients know it, how it, it, it takes hard work, patience, and per, per, perseverance. So in that sense, uh, what tips do you have for job seekers in order to have a good strategy so that they can implement their job search these days? I think one thing that I've been that I've been working with clients on and that I've been kind of sitting in LinkedIn and, and doing comments about is taking a look back, like like stopping, just, just stop before you jump into applications, LinkedIn, scrolling, looking at profiles and all that, and just kind of take inventory of, of where you've been. And, and the first point I'd like to make is like, look back at any other job searches you've had. I don't care if it was for a fast food chain when you were in high school or just what made you like successful there? Did you, mm. were you good at talking to people? Was it, oh, you were really organized and came to the table well-prepared and just kind of look back on those things. More often than not, you've had a job search that has gone well. Yeah. Um, and so look back at that and realize, hey, where are my superpowers? What do I bring to the table when I'm hunting down that job? Mm -hmm. My second point there would just be the clarity piece, right? When I, when I first, when a client comes to me and they say, hey, Dominic, like, I want job search coaching. We're going to go through the conversations over applications method. Great. Our first session is there just me asking them the hard questions, right? What, what do you want to do? Where, where do you want to go? Do we need to look back in order to figure out where we're going? So I think the first piece is clarity. Yeah. Um, taking that, those couple hours, whether it's right, you, yourself, your room, a piece of paper and pen and journaling it out and tr just figuring it out, sitting with your own thoughts and figuring out where you want to go. I think that clarity piece and looking back at where you've gotten results yeah. um, is really important in the job search. And I always tell my clients that have a strategy, like write it down. Monday mornings, networking, maybe in the afternoon, commenting. Tuesday, maybe you want to go out for a walk or go to the gym. And in the afternoon, meet someone to have a conversation. And then maybe Wednesday morning, have informative session. But if that clarity is important, you cannot say, I want a job. You need to be specific. What's your skill set and how you can achieve, right? Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, you see the the board yeah. back there, right? Keep yeah. keep it organized. When I was in, when I was hunting down my first job, and I didn't have a, a board or anything like that, like I just had pieces of paper printed and slapped on the wall of like yeah. my target role list. So like anytime I walked by or I had got off a call or something like that, I could make a little note. Hey, this is doing that. And I think what you had in there is also just like breaks and making it fun like go do activities that energize you like yeah. focus on those where you're getting results it's really important yeah and in, and in celebrate small wins you know you applied or someone called you or you met someone even if the job wasn't successful you didn't get it but you learned something and it can be better next time yeah 100 percent. you really gotta uh just enjoy it what a, hey uh, i had a client or i had a um an audience member comment on one of my posts that about a rough interview and how, and how tough it was and what I responded back and they were really feeling it. And it was like, Hey, you made it, you, you made it there. That one wasn't for you, but there's going to be another one that comes yeah. up. Yeah. Those are great tips, Dominic. Thank you very much. So for the audience watching or listening for the first time, I'm going to ask Dominic a couple of questions and I'm going to post them on a daily basis, kind of a journey with us. You can like all the videos, make comment and share. So tune in next time for another great question with Dominic.